and welcome back to my channel so if you have clicked on this video that means you want to stay healthy and want to change your habits and want to make things comfortable and you're totally on the right place because i'm going to show you some tips on how to stay healthy and how to be on the right track and also this video would be two-parted that means the first part would be how to stay healthy and the tips and everything that you want to know and the second video would be all about recipes and snacks and everything covered up so you guys are good to go. I know staying healthy can be really difficult to achieve but once you get the hang of it, it will be super easy. So if you guys like seeing this video, give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you are not following me on my Instagram, make sure you do so. And before you get into the video, comment down below and tell me what device do you use to watch your YouTube videos. Do you use your phone or do you use your computers? Because I mainly think that people use their phone to watch YouTube videos but let me know because I'm super curious. I hope you guys are having an amazing day so far and without further ado, do let's get into it. starting off with our video my first trick is really easy and it is portion sizes so basically i've seen people using this plate and it's really huge and this plate can feed two people but instead of using this plate you can use this plate but if you know your portion size and if you fill your plate this much psychologically your brain will trick you and make you feel like you know i'm still hungry because this plate is still not fully covered but if you use this plate your brain will automatically think that you have a lot to eat on this plate and it will not make you feel hungry my second tip is to switch up your health routine and get super fit and healthy for 2019 it does not mean that you have to eat salad for the rest of your year but just open your fridge and think what you can swap something out for me i swapped yogurt with greek yogurt potato chips with popcorn and white bread to brown bread my next tip is to get your greens first so if you are eating pasta or if you are eating something junky just don't bash yourself because if you are feeling like it, just eat it. If you want to eat pasta, make sure that you have a salad or a bowl of salad just beside you. So you can fill the plate half with greens and half with pasta. And eating your green first, make sure that you are still healthy. My next step would be to drink a lot of water. And if you are someone like me who does not drink a lot of water, I found this app on Play Store and I was so excited to try it. So this app is basically called Plant Nanny. And what this app does is it keeps a track on how much water you are taking throughout the day. This app will ask you how much do you weigh and according to that it will show you how much liters of water do you need to drink on a daily basis. So for my body that I have to drink 10 glasses of water a day and I have done that so yay. And my plant is currently sad because yesterday I didn't have enough water so it's sad today. So if you drink water, your plant will be happy and if you just don't drink water, your plant will get sad and you will also feel sad if your plant is sad. So indirectly, you are going to drink a lot of water. So it's pretty simple and yeah, it gets the best out of me. So I can drink a lot of water. And if you are someone who does not like the taste of water, so you can use detox water. I'll have some of my favorite detox water listed on the screen. And as everybody knows that human body is made of 60% of water, so it's really important to drink water. My next step would be to get outside and you don't need gym equipment to get out. You can literally just go outside and run into your neighborhood or just take a skipping rope and skip outside. And I have recently read that going outside can reduce stress relief. So if you're personally stressed out, head outside. My next step is to jump on the choo-choo train. And if you don't know, if you chew your food properly, you will consume 10% less calories. So make sure that you're chewing your food properly. My next step would be to plan your breakfast the day before because that way you're kind of prepared and you won't eat unnecessary things if you're unprepared and it will be like, no, I can eat pasta the day because I haven't planned much. So planning your food will make you on track and you won't eat unnecessary things. My next step would be to take a break. Now, if you're walking out so much and Giving yourself a break would be a much better option. For me, taking a break, I would watch Netflix movies or just binge watch Riverdale because it's my favorite. Comment down below and tell me if you are a Riverdale fan as well. So that is it for our video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did this, give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And if you guys aren't following me on my Instagram, make sure you do so. And comment down below and tell me what device do you use to watch your YouTube videos on. Do you use your phone or do you use